Choosing the right website builder can make or break your SEO efforts. If you are serious about driving traffic to your website from search engines, then you need a platform that supports SEO from the ground up. But which website builder is best for SEO? Let's find out. So in this video, we are going to take a look at best website builders for SEO that you can use to build your business website so that you can rank higher in search engines and get free traffic from there. And as we all know that there are several website builders out there, but not all of them are created equally when it comes to SEO. So here is our pick for best website builders for SEO, starting with number one, and that is WordPress. And hands down, WordPress is the best platform that you can use to build your website if getting traffic from search engine or SEO is your primary goal. And that's why there is a reason that most of the websites on the internet are powered by WordPress only. And if you are new to WordPress, then it's an open source platform which gives you complete control over your website. You can optimize every part of your website, especially SEO as well, from meta tags to URLs or even technical SEO elements like site speed, mobile responsiveness, and lot more. Now, one of the biggest reasons WordPress is so great for SEO is its extensive plugin library, especially plugins like Rank Math or Yoast SEO plugin. These plugins guide you step by step on how to improve your content, website structure, and keywords for better search engine rankings. So whether you are running a blog or an online store or maybe a portfolio site or maybe a small business website, WordPress gives you the flexibility to scale your SEO efforts to any extent. So if you are looking best website builders for SEO, then hands down, there is no one near WordPress. And if you want to learn how you can create a WordPress website using AI in just a few clicks, then make sure you watch this video right here. Next in our list is Wix, a beginner friendly website builder that's great for anyone who wants to get a website up quickly without any technical know-how. But how does it work in terms of SEO? Well, Wix does offer some built-in SEO tools like customizable meta tags and SEO wizard that walks you through some basic optimization, but it's nowhere close to the flexibility of WordPress. And the biggest downside is the Wix custom URLs and the site structure, which are not SEO friendly at all. And this is a big limit for your SEO potential in long run. Next up in our list is Squarespace. Now, Squarespace is known for its beautiful templates. But again, how good is that for SEO? Now, Squarespace does have SEO tools and their site are mobile responsive right out of the box, which is a good part for SEO, but a very small one. However, the platform does offer some advanced SEO features, but again, it's not close to WordPress. It's a good choice for users who want aesthetically pleasing website with basic SEO features. But again, for those who need advanced SEO capabilities and complete control, it falls a bit short. Next up in our list is Hostinger Website Builder. Now, Hostinger's Website Builder is relatively new to the scene, but it's making a name for itself with its ease of use and affordability. But let's talk about SEO here. The platform offers solid SEO tools like customizable URLs, meta descriptions, and mobile optimization. While it's not as robust as WordPress again, but Hostinger is a good choice if you want a simple effective website without breaking your bank. So which page builder is best for SEO? If you want full control, scalability and advanced SEO features, then WordPress is hands down the best website builder for SEO. Wix is for those who are beginners and looking for ease of use to create a website. And Squarespace is great for design focused user who just want a website with a sleek and clean look. And if we talk about Hostinger, it's idle for those who are on budget but still need some good SEO tools. So if you are looking for a website builder which is best for SEO, then first choice is of course WordPress. But if in case you don't want to get into the learning curve of WordPress, then you can go with Hostinger Website Builder. And all the relevant links you can find in the video description below. So in the end, make sure you leave a comment below and do let us know which website builder you are using and doing SEO for your website. And if you have any questions regarding SEO or website builders in general or WordPress in general, then make sure you leave your questions in the comment section below. And if you like this video, then make sure you give it a like and share it with your friends and community. And for more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. 
that's it for this one and i'll see you in the next video